it is time, ladies and gents, to start taking a look at Dage's birthday for 2021. If you haven't already, make sure you smash that subscribe button and, of course, leave the video with a like. So, as we're calling it, the pre-release has come out. So, everything's added into the game, just not everything's available yet. But most importantly, what we can do is have a look in this dark birthday token shop, which is what many of you were hoping would get updated. And, yes, we sure enough have got some new items you can get in here with your Legion token, specifically the Legion operative set. And I believe there is another one, potentially the Scout, but I think that may have been there last year. It gets a bit confusing in my head, so I thought we'd go for through and I'll show you every single item that's in it just so we don't miss anything as we go through but I will go over a bit slower the bits that I thought were actually new for this year. So you've just seen the Legion operative which is one of the ones I showed you in a gossip video a little while ago so it's great to see that added in. There's also the Marauder and the Scout. I feel like they were there before but I just I generally just can't remember off the top of my head but there's plenty of new helms in here. I know Pharaoh's done a few of these. So again here are the Marauder helms. I do actually really like these ones and I would say you know what there are only a few Legion tokens you go along pick these up and especially with the boost that's currently on. I'm sure most of you have your Legion tokens stacked up. Please don't slate me too much. I'm fully aware I don't even have 2,000 Legion tokens at the minute, but that's just the way it's gone. I really haven't had the time to go along and farm all those, but we will worry about that over the weekend. We've got some quite nice cows here and sort of skull hoods. Again, really am quite a fan of these, mostly to go with the Legion operative set. And then you've got your little dark caster bits down the bottom. We do have some hair locks to go with it as well. So there are the operative ones, male and female variants, of course, because we have to have one of each. So guys, one thing I would say on this shop is to make sure you do check back each week because there's always the potential they're going to add more into this as the time goes on. Of course, we know the rare shop will be getting two separate updates, one on week two and one on week three. So that usually adds in an extra armor or two. So that's always something to get quite excited for hopefully we're going to see whatever the new paragon is i'm really hopeful for that this year and it will just be a matter of time will tell probably by the time this is up the event will have fully dropped if it hasn't that is why you can't actually find a proper rare shop or the new pvp amulet which we're going to have to cover lots of exciting things including lucky day so just stay tuned anyway guys thank you all very much for watching make sure you leave the video a like and of course subscribe and i'm going to be back very very soon with lots of new content on the way for you this evening so until then have a a lovely day.